It went quite well. I really enjoyed myself. Like there were, you know, blunders here and there, but overall, like the, the performance experience was really, really nice. And the best part about being in this competition is that it's hosted in an art gallery, and I'm actually gonna go in and enjoy the exhibition now. <laughs> So basically, I got a call from the Birmingham competition saying that I got into the second round, and here we go again. I'm just gonna go through the whole roller coaster all over again, and I'm super exhausted. I'm excited to go back and play, actually. It's a really, really nice hall, it's a great piano, and I feel like the audience is really receptive. Like today, after my performance, there was a mom, like she just took her kids and, like, you know, went up to me and said, like, well done and all that, and like they really enjoyed my performance. It's almost such a nice weekend activity for families to go to, just the entire family going to enjoy some classical music. So, yeah, I, I really like the vibe of this competition, and I'm happy to go back tomorrow, even though I'm like, oh, super drained. My shoulders are killing me. These muscles here are really just like, they're cramping up. They're just dying for a massage right now, which I'll definitely get one tomorrow night. Best boyfriend ever. He's taking care of all the logistics for me this morning so I can just focus on performing. He's my slave for the day. The, it was only because you couldn't do it yourself. And I thought you were a feminist. Well, I just called you my slave, so I don't know how, how much more feminist that can get. I don't know what you think words can do, <laughs> but that doesn't change the reality. <laughs> Time to stop living in a bubble of fake news. Why are we even still using paper tickets? Oh my god. You know adoption for, for like mobile phone tickets is ridiculously you know?
I played the Beethoven 110 just now and then this contemporary piece I played a few years ago. The contemporary piece, I had a little bit of a page turn hiccup because I decided not to play it from memory. But in general, it was good. Although I did feel like the acoustics was a little bit muffled, so I kept like pushing the sound. Like I felt like I was working against something. And also I think because like the acoustics itself is dry, it kind of makes it easier to feel the audience vibe, if you get what I mean. It's easier to kind of feel the, the atmosphere, I think. Now I'm gonna go do some sightseeing. I always feel so light after I perform. Honestly, I always feel like I'm 10 pounds lighter after I perform. It's a very nice feeling. It's like an endorphin high. It's like after people run marathons. Gardens were probably built for like couples to come and make out in because there's just all these like random benches. Like what? You can't just sit here and enjoy. Oh no, actually you can. It's beautiful. For you. Hey, two makeup spots. Go makeout go. spot. Makeout spot. And two. two benches. So two makeup spots. Makeout spot. Makeout spot. Makeout spot. Makeout spot. Makeout spot. Make spot. And just in case there's any more doubt about what this spot is for, makeout spot. Mm. So I didn't get to vlog this after I got the call. Basically, I got into the finals for the Birmingham competition. So... <sighs> mm -hmm.